Welcome to Photoshop. The first question looking at this window is probably going to be, did he land that jump? And the answer is, yes, he did. And this is all the proof I have. So let's close this one and look at this picture. Uh, the first thing to note is that I'm using CS2, an older version of Photoshop. You're likely working with either CS3 or CS4. And as such, things are likely to look a little bit different. These bar, uh, this bar here is the toolbox. It might be in one row. If you can get it to show up in two rows, I recommend it. Otherwise, you're just going to have to hunt a little bit to find the same options that I'm working with. Um, I have this picture here. Uh, this is a Photoshop uh, CS3 screenshot. Um, the most important hidden tool that you're going to use all the time is the history palette. The shortcut for undo in Photoshop is Control Z, but that switches between undo and redo. Uh, so if you want to back up a step, you need to use Control Alt Z. Uh, an easier way to undo things in Photoshop is to open the history palette by either clicking this button here or by looking over here in your palettes um, and scrolling up on the list and clicking on the previous state that you want to uh, want to look at. But let's start with the toolbox.